All right, this is Carla J with Humor Mill TV, and we are here with the one and only. The party does not get started without this man right here. This is the one and only Ali. Ali Sadiq, what's happening, y'all? How y'all feeling? Um, big shout out to Humor Mill. First time y'all ever interviewing me. You know, I understand. You know, but it's all good. What's up, Frank? <laughs> That's right. And we're here in Houston, Texas. We had to get you at the homestead. You know, uh, Humor Mill TV is all over the place, and we just wanted to catch you when we're right here in Houston. Cool. I'm here. I'm here on, on you know, this is, y'all got me on a lucky weekend. The tour's in town. I'm here. I'm never really here on the weekends. But I'm here um, during the week, though. You know, my family's here. So we, we kicking and having a great time. It is. Okay. So, Ali, talk to me. Tell me about any upcoming projects that you have going on. How can we stay in, uh, connected with the man? Man, I really don't like people following me like that. You know, I don't like people out of my business like that. Um, let me see. I just finished the Showtime thing with Bill. We got another Showtime special coming out. Um, me, I'm just working. I'm just on the road, man. I'm, I'm not the one you want to interview about upcoming projects because everybody got the same grind. Ain't nobody got shit going on out here um, besides what them Jews is doing for us. Um, and that's, that's, here or that's here and there. So really, me, I'm just on the road grinding, trying to stay in these improvs, trying to stay on the road, trying to get big. All the people lying to my, they got projects and shit coming out, they ain't got shit going on. <laughs> White folks ain't doing nothing for nobody. Now, me, I'm really starting the process of writing more. Mm -hmm. You know, just writing, trying to get in the writer's guild, mm -hmm. um, helping, you know, anybody who want me to write for them. So if anybody needs some writers, I'm out here. You know, and then I got a little sitcom that I'm working on. I'm not really giving none, none of it up right yet, you know, because Ricky Hughes told me not to. She told me just hold what I got until. You know what? That, that's okay. We'll catch you next time exactly. when you can right. talk about it. Yeah, right. I can't talk about what I got going on. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I'm out here, though. You know, got to, well, we in Chicago next week, and mm -hmm. then I'm um, headlining at the Improv in Arlington and the, um, San Antonio, LOL, getting these little clubs. You know, I'm, 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 I'm. You grinding. You 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 have stuff going on. Steady on the thing. You know, they should have called me when I was on HBO and, and, and when I was doing all that. One mic stand and all the rest of that. Y'all late, man. Y'all kids me on the late train. You know what? No, 14 no. Years, Fourteen years of me out here. You know what? But we, we got you. You know what? You you just getting you you're at your at your peak, you know. You got it going on and, and you got better things I bigger and better things I coming. I have not peaked. No, you got bigger and better things. <laughs> you got bigger and better oh, things coming up. No, this isn't the peak, but you know you got bigger and better things going on. So you know, and we want to catch you right now, so that you know later on you don't forget. You don't forget who the little people are. You know. Man, I don't forget nobody. You can't because the same people you see on the way up, you see on the way down. You see doing the ride. You know, when you blowing cocaine on white girls and doing all that, you will see people. <laughs> You know, you remember, people remember you like, what, you blowing cocaine two years ago? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No. Yeah, you gotta, that's what you got to do. You got to have a party, man. You got to come in with a clip bag of cocaine and just start throwing cocaine on the people. You don't do cocaine. You just make, it's like, what, what was that club? What was that club in New York that was blowing cocaine in events? Um, he know. What was the name of it? <laughs> Studio 54. What did I tell you? See, that's what I am. I'm, a, I'm walking through your 54. You don't never know. Look at that cocaine all on my shirt. Yeah, man, yeah. I'm, you know, what we're doing is we just we just grind. I'm out here with Bill right now. Mm -hmm. I was with DL for a while. Yeah. I did something with Tracy Morgan. He's supposed to start a tour. He See, all my stuff is supposed to. I don't like that. You but know. you know what? It's going gonna, it's gonna to come to fruition. That somebody else gave me. Then next year, what happened when they don't want to do it? Now I'm sitting back like, damn. Wasn't Ali supposed to be <laughs> You know what? And when it comes to fruition, we're going to be right back there. Humor Mill is going to be right there to interview you. Yeah. So you're going to be fine. It's a, it's a bunch of brothers grinding out there, but you got major hustle. You've been around for a minute. Man, I've been you know? for a minute. See, that's why I understand a lot of these comics, man. I don't even respect the comics until they go through some summers. You got you to gotta make it through the summer. Yeah. See, uh, see, when the colleges are out and, mm -hmm. and all of that corny shit, I'm still working. Because I'm, you know, I'm not in the colleges like that. I'm just on the road. I'm actually out here just really just grinding. You know, you kind of take different steps toward different things. You know, I wasted a lot of time doing what they call a chitlin circuit and just black yeah. rooms. Mm -hmm. So for the last five years, I've just been actually becoming mainstream, mm -hmm. opening, opening for anybody, featuring for anybody, going, going to these clubs, taking any day that they got, and just, you know, just working it out, you know, constantly doing material. You know, the, my next special that I'm shooting myself would be my quest to be more pleasant. That's going to mm -hmm. be... It's a whole different ride of just how people are so miserable in their life and they don't get a, they don't really focus on being pleasant. 
yeah. you know, you know, a lot of a lot of things out here, man. And um, I think I got a, I think a, this sitcom, man. I think it's gonna be a hot one because it's definitely different. Mm -hmm. It's never been, the story has never been told because it's my story. That's right. You know, so I'm not writing. I'm not writing anything from a fictitious place. I'm writing from actually what goes on with me and where I'm from and what I deal with and you know what go actually goes on in my life. That's you know. Right. But my actual project is definitely Birds of a Feather. Birds of a Feather is really a lot of comics that's the same kind of cats. Yeah. But the actual two is me and Delay. We do like a little thing in action on stage together mm -hmm. that you never know when it's coming because we like the same kind of cats. You know, we ri he, when Delay come in here, if y'all doing Delay, Delay right. is going to tell a yeah. story mm -hmm. about how we was in downtown L.A. trying to get a fake ID. No way. Yeah, he gonna tell you this story, <laughs> and we could have went to the DMV and just got a real ID, but that's too easy. It's too easy. We need. That's to what be, I was gonna ask. How old were y'all when y'all we were need, doing that? Oh, uh, this was like four weeks ago. This wasn't no. You this know was, what? <laughs> this was wow. like, this was like a long time ago. This is like four weeks, man. Because we always into something, you know. That's my mm -hmm. that's my road dog, man. Yeah. Birds with feather, you know. Together, you you know right. you know who your bird is. You know who to call. Yeah, that's you know right. Saying? I know the bird call. Who, who <laughs> you throw that? Who would throw that pistol to that? Clean up and throw it out. You know. That's right. Yeah, that's my cat, man. That's and right. you know, and there's a lot of great cats out here, man. Sydney Castillo and um, Lil Rail and myself and Malik S and JJ from Mississippi, man. Big shout out to all these cats that's grinding. Delay, man, it's a lot of great cats out yeah. there and really, realistically, it's some cats that need to move out the way mm -hmm. so some of these other cats that's fresh faces with new ideas can come in. Mm -hmm. That's out. right. You said it. <laughs> all right. Y'all heard it here. Ali Sadiq from Houston, Texas at the Humor Mill.